All right, so here I'm gonna show you guys the Bretzel 2.0 stretch. Uh, this is a really great uh, posterior stretch for both the lower body and upper body. Um, it also requires a bit different setup compared to the Bretzel 1.0 uh, that I showed earlier. So here we're gonna start in what we call that shin box position, right? So I'm sitting upright, but my front thigh and outside leg are both flat on the ground, inside, back, thigh, and shin are both on the ground. From here, I'm gonna place my right hand, if my right thigh is in front, back, so that my fingers are facing away from me, right, you know, about maybe a foot or so outside of my right hip. My left hand is then gonna come, and I'm gonna place it underneath my right hand, right, so I'll actually turn, show you guys a little bit more here, right, so hand, you got about a foot away, fingers pointing behind me, now I'm going to slide my left hand and lock it in with the right. So here, again, I'm already kind of feeling a little bit of a, a mobility restriction within my hip and my back. Say so from here, while keeping that left arm pinned down, I'm just trying to drop my front shoulder to the ground and come back up. Again, I should feel a nice strong stretch within the outside part of my front hip and maybe a little bit within the spine as well as we do a little bit of a side bend and rotation. And then come right back up, kind of move out of it, obviously flip, set up, exact same thing on that other side. 